Hello critters and welcome back to the Crafty Critter. So we need to catch up on this. I think the last day I posted was the 9th. Uh, it's just been super busy days and I haven't been able to get into this. So um, uh, we are going to basically, I'm going to film for it once. So um, yeah, we're just going to do that. So that means I need to pop open the tent here. And I pre kind of cut some of these so that I can cut back on time. So it looks like we have a sentiment for the ninth. So we have birthday. This is not going at all how I thought it would be going with this. So interesting. Okay, so we have, here we go, we have the ninth or the tenth. So then we need the 11th next. So we're going to open all these, then I'm going to stamp them, and yeah, we'll just kind of go that. Okay, so the 11th is here. It's a bigger, it's bigger. Okay, we have, um, how pretty is that? It's a dragonfly. Interesting. That's going to be pretty to color. Okay, so we have a dragonfly for the 11th. Okay, so now we need the 12th. So a sentiment. And this makes sense. Got happy. Okay. And one more to catch up, and then we'll be back on track for this week. And that's the 13th. Oh, it's a little bigger. It's kind of off to the side right here. Oh, interesting. Hmm. I do not know where this is going. I guess this is kind of more just like a, a random through the year kind of thing, but uh, we have a pumpkin. It's a cute pumpkin, too. Okay. So, let me uh, move this out of the way. All right. And then I'm going to bring you down here. So, we have... Here's our four. To catch us up. So, we have the 10th, the 11th, the 12th, and the 13th. And I am filming here, Sunday the 13th. It will get posted. So, I'm going to do some stamping here now. Okay, let's see here if we can... That somewhat came out. I didn't press it very good. Let's see if we could get a... Nope. Perfect. That one's much better. Okay, so that's the one we're going to stamp out. Or punch out. second here let's all right I will clean all of these afterwards as soon as I'm trying to find the end of my washi tape here oh my okay I got it That one's going to go on the big shot. All right. Next up is our dragonfly. And let's see if we can get a good one. Mm, kind of smudged a little there. Let's see if we can get a 
Oh, much better. A little light, but not bad. That's much better. All right, let's cut that one out. We'll punch that one out. We can get this one right first time. Ooh, no. I pressed too hard. I pressed too light. It's like playing the three little bear game. This one's too soft and that one's too light. This one's just right. There's happy, and we need to get, I need to get another piece of paper here, and we need to try this for this pumpkin. How interesting is all of this? I mean, there's no, like, rhyme or reason as to what's going on here. It's just kind of weird. Um, I was expecting all Christmas stamps, and then we're getting all these random sentiments and yeah hey I got that one great trial and error folks trial and error yeah, I've just started doing stamping I have only had this big shot for six months so like the whole like stamping and cutting out of things is all just so very new to me and I'm learning all about like the different, you know, if you press too hard, it's not right, and you know, all of those fun things. So, yeah, all right, let's get the uh plate on. All right, and let's feed it through. That's one, that's two. Sorry, I keep bumping the camera. That's three, and we're at the fourth. There we go. All right. All right. Let's just pull all these down. All right. I'm going to push that through. So here is Happy. It came out really nice. It sure did. All right, so there's Happy. We'll line up our stamps here in a second. Here's our pumpkin. And we get to color the pumpkin. So there's the pumpkin. dragonfly here, which we also get to color. So there's the dragonfly, and then we have the word birthday. And I've been actually throwing all these sentiments into my little trinket catcher here. I'll pull that out here in a second. they're all in here so 
we'll be moving these into there too when they're done. All right, let me get a wipe here. And we're going to put all these stamps. I'm just cleaning these off camera, so yeah, sorry. Hopefully I can stay on top of this a little bit better this week. All right, there's the block cleaned off. here and dragonfly okay dragonfly and then happy oops I got it upside down happy all right let me get Markers. Let's go with. We will do an orange pumpkin. Traditional, I know. Get some of this cleaned up here. Off to the side. the pumpkin. I hope y'all are enjoying this, watching me catch up on what I'm doing is kind of the shadowing here. Pumpkin with the shadow, and we'll come a little to the top. Okay, and then we'll need we will need a brown or something for the stem. So let's get that stem done. color. I'm feeling blue and green for the dragonfly. And as soon as I stop filming then these will go in my little trinket container that I have. And I want to use them at the end of the month we're gonna do something with them i'm thinking that i might just take these and kind of decorate the uh my monthly spread for my um channel with them you know on the days that i made these kind of put them in there i thought that might be cute okay there's that one. That one don't get colored. That one don't get colored. This one gets colored. So, here's the green. We got this blue. We got this blue. We got that green. I'm just going to pull 
other greens and we'll go from there. So these are all greens and yeah, I'm thinking let's do like um maybe do part of his body black or right here is little like feet and maybe his eyes black. Yeah, that'll be good. Alright. And let's start with maybe let's do a darker torso. So let's go with this this blue. Kind of fill him in here. And in here. And then we'll do a dark green. And then we will do kind of all the lighter colors. So let's, I'm not intending on using that blue again. Let's do this dark green in here. And maybe one of the segments here. Do a lighter green to fill in the rest of those segments and then we'll do all these pretty paler colors for the wings He's turning out very nice. Oh, this one's more of a purple. Interesting. Right, and then we'll just finish up these three shades here as two. This is turning out really cute. Yeah, we're getting up there in time though. Uh, we are filming through at once here, so bear with me, we're almost there. What a pretty little dragonfly you turned out to be. All the two colors are the same next to each other, but that's okay. There we go, guys. Honestly, I think it's really cute. I think they're all very cute. All right, let me bring these down here. And then I'm going to put the camera a couple close up here so you can see all this. All right, here we 
we go. How cute. Sorry for the glare. These are very cute. Very, very cute. Thank you for joining me. Um, sorry that we had to do more of a catch-up session with this, but um, eh, maybe next week, this coming week, will be a little bit better. I'm really hoping it will be so I can stay on top of this. Um, I very much like opening these one day at a time instead of like the four like this. So um, again, thank you for joining me. I am so happy that you did. Um, please hit the thumbs up. Yay, thumbs up. And... Um, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. I will see you in future videos and thank you so much for joining me. Bye bye critters!